Hello friends, welcome back to Popcorn in Bed. Thank you as always for being here. We are heading into scary but not too scary October. And I am so happy to sprinkle some beautiful Baby Yoda in there with these spooky movies as I start Mandalorian season two. I was like, well, should I go right into season two? Cause there's all these new shows coming out. Maybe I should watch those. Are people sick of it? So I had a poll on my Patreon of what TV show should I watch next? So Mandalorian season two right away. Rings of Power, runners up from our previous TV show poll, which was Queen's Gambit and True Detective season one. Haunting of Hill House, cause October was coming. Anyways, Mandalorian season two right away won by a long shot. So here I am. I am not gonna lie. I was a little bit excited that that one won. I may have cast my own vote on that one as well. Season one overall was just so surprising to me. I think I said after the first episode like it felt like Star Wars. Like I felt the magic. Every episode had some kind of an adventure and fun and mystery and I'm hoping that season two has more of a backstory I guess on who Baby Yoda is. <sighs> who Mandalorian is. Yes, I know I need to watch Clone Wars, I'm sorry. I have been very careful to avoid any spoilers and I've actually been very good at it. I haven't watched the trailer to season three, so I don't know much about season two other than stars are a famous duo, Sexy Mandy and Baby Yoda. Let's get started. Remember, if you want to vote on the polls, watch full length reactions, hang out with movie lovers, and join a couple thousand of us who are having a blast on Patreon, here it is right here, my Patreon. And always, if that is not a possibility or something you want to do, that's totally fine. But would you just clickety click that little like button for me? If you're not subscribed, I would super appreciate that. We're getting so close to 250,000, which is mind-blowing if you want to know when we have premieres and whatnot there's a little bell okay let's do it previously on the mandalorian how was that there is one show the mandalorian shot up the guild and went rogue that's because he puts a spell on all of us. I will be free until the old ways are gone. Quill, that one hurt. He must reunite him with its own cow. <laughs> oh yeah, he got his jet back. Ooh, this guy. I saw a toy at Costco that is a carriage that follows you. <laughs> I weirdly really wanted it. I just want that baby to follow me. So now it's like an ice age journey, right? Return the child to his people. It's like almost for a second you forget what galaxy you're in and then you see Shrek's gone wrong like this fighting each other. I've been requested to bring him to his kind. If I can locate other Mandalorians, they can help guide me. I'm told you know where to find them. Finish him! Don't let the baby see that. Not when it can be avoided. I'll bet you the information you seek. This Gamorrean's gonna die within the next minute and a half. Not even my fate up to chance. Nor am I. Uh, this took a turn. Beskar's value continues to rise. Tell me where the Mandalorians are and I'll walk out of here without killing you. But you said you weren't the gambler. I'm not. So got it. I like how he had like 11 guns pointed at him. He's like, I'm not face. I tell you, Angus, you must give me your word that you won't kill me. I promise you will not die by my hand. Tatooine? <gasps> what? I know that. The man who I know of. He said he almost fell down. Tatooine it is then. You can't leave me like this. Cut me down. That wasn't part of the deal. Daniel! Daniel! Ooh, I feel like that was dark for him. Doo -doo -doo. Whoa. Love her. Love him. All right. Sorry, gang. You know he doesn't like droids. 
May as well let them have at it. He's changed his tune a little bit after his friend. Oh, oh. Come here, you little womp rat. How much do you want for it? Just kidding, but not really. <laughs> Where is Moss Pelgo? R5, bring the map of Tatooine. Now take your time, seriously. You just can't get good help anymore. Okay. Most Isley, most Espa, most Pelgo. You still have that speeder bike? Sure do. It was a little rusty, but I got it. I love their friendship, I think. Look at all the friends he's making on his adventures. Well, this looks happy. Can I help you? I'm looking for a Mandalorian. Can you describe him? Someone who looks like me. You mean the Marshal? Your Marshal wears Mandalorian armor. See for yourself. We quick. Two snorts of Spotska. Is he legit Mandalorian? Why don't you join me for a drink? He almost looks like someone who found a Mandalorian costume at a thrift store and put it on as his own. Oh. I've never met a real Mandalorian. I know you're good at killing. And probably none too happy to see me wearing this hardware. Oh, I was right. I figure only one of us walking out of here. But then I see the little guy. And I think maybe I picked you wrong. Who are you? I'm Cobb Vance. Marshal of Mos Pelgo. Where did you get the armor? Bought off some Jawas. Hand it over. See the guy in Once Upon a Time in Hollywood? Just for that little part in Time in Hollywood? Where I will. Okay. We gonna do this in front of the kid? Oh. You seen worse. This guy's like, oh man, my bar is about to get wrecked. Is this like a tornado warning? Uh. How are we staying so calm? Maybe we can work something out. Uh, that poor little buffalo mammoth thing. Thanks to this armor, I've been able to protect this town from the Creek Dragon. It's too much for me to take on alone. I don't know that. Kill it, I'll give you the armor. Deal. I think I trust him. It started after we got news of the Death Star blowing up. The second one, that is. That very night, the mining collective moved in. Most Belgo became a slave camp overnight. The mining collective? What? I lit out, grabbed the camp tono. I had no idea it was full of silicax crystals. I guess every once in a while, both sunshine on a womp rat's tail. I wandered for days. And then I was saved. By those scavenger guys. My treasure bought me more than a full water skin. It bought my freedom. It's not like best car like his, is it? Okay, still works. Thrift store or not. Oh. What the hell are you done? What? They're like Skeleton dinosaurs. What? Hey, partner, you want to tell me what's going on? They want to kill the great dragon, too. Ooh. It stinks. You want their help? Not if I have to drink this. This was a bad idea. You're agitating them. You sit back there before I put a hole through you. What are you telling them? Same thing I'm telling you. If we fight amongst ourselves, the monster will kill us all. Now, how do we kill it? Gotta work together, boys. I feel like those are something a poacher would really want. They have very nice horns.
It lives in an abandoned Sarlacc pit. There's no such thing. There is if you eat the Sarlacc. They feed the dragon to make it sleep longer. These sand people are like what I imagined Reavers looked like in Firefly. Oh my gosh. Yikes. They might be open to some fresh ideas. Those little rocks. That's us. Where are they getting the reinforcements? I volunteered your village. This here is a Mandalorian. Oh, we've heard the stories. And you know how good they are at killing. We can't take on the crate alone. And the sand people are willing to help. <laughs> they are raiders. It's true, but they also keep their word. If we are willing to leave them the carcass, we will stand by our side in battle and vow never to raise a blaster against this town until one of you breaks the peace. Mm -hmm. This music is good this episode. Ah. Warm Coke. I'm desperate. Oh. <laughs> That's that new marshmallow. What are you trying to blow the whole place up? It was an accident. Ugh, it tastes like medicine and pine trees. It's gonna be great. <laughs> This is it? We're doing it? We're going right in? Does this guy have to sacrifice himself? He says it's sleeping. If we listen carefully, we can hear it breathing. Let's get to work. The Tuscans say the belly is the only weak spot, so we have to hit it from below. Get it angry enough to charge. Careful, Marshal. Thank you, Joe. And you stay safe, huh? Run for life! Oh, that is unsettling. Oh. Sick, 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 sick. Dang, Ferric, it's going back in. <gasps> let go, let go, let go, let go, let go. I'm gonna hit it. No, wait. We wait. only have one shot. Gotta wait for the belly. Agitate it. Agitate it. Holy. How did they make that look like that? I feel like we're doing pretty good working together. <gasps> ew, ew. What's happening? Did you just slime them? Did it work? I don't think it's dead. Me either. Maybe you shouldn't just stand there. Ew. Oh my gosh. That's so disgusting. Let's get after it. Why is it puking on them? Is its puke toxic? They look like tiny little ants next to it. Oh my gosh! I've got an idea. Get its attention. I've got its attention. You don't have that detonator. What's the plan? Take care of a child. What are you gonna do? I don't know, but wish me luck. Oh my gosh. Did did. We did it eat, Mando. We need like a Jonah and the whale situation right now. I don't understand. Not again. Sorry, I didn't have time to explain. No need. Mm -hmm. Well learned. It was my pleasure. I hope our paths cross again. As do I. And you tell your people I wasn't the one that broke that. Ew. I liked the marshal. I hope their paths cross again too. Ooh. 
Should I have known who that guy at the end was? That was a fun episode. These adventures, like I just love that each episode we get to like go to a new planet and have a new adventure. <laughs> I keep saying that. Still didn't see as much Baby Yoda as I want to. I want to see more of him and his powers and what he is. And I just really liked that whole story, how they weaved that all together, how that guy is not actually a Mandalorian, but just had the armor from those guys. But who was the Mandalorian that gave up the armor? Or did they send people just, you know, it was action packed. We had a plan, people coming together, setting aside their differences against a common enemy. It was really fun. I loved the uh, Marshall. He was just likable and teamwork makes the dream work, guys. Okay, cannot wait to see what happens in the next episode. <gasps> Thank you, Julie. Look at this side. Mm. Okay, I think we're still on Tatooine. Okay. What the baby? You wouldn't. If you put one mark on him, there's no place you will be able to hide from me. Okay. It's yours. Take it. You okay? Are you okay? So were they targeting Mando specifically or just anyone traveling through the desert? It's almost like a baby Bjorn. I told you that's what he needed. You finally found a Mandalorian and you killed him? He wasn't Mandalorian. I bought this armor off of him though. What'd that set you back? Killed the great dragon for him. Is that all? He was my last lead on finding other Mandalorians. Dr. Mandible here says he can connect you with someone who can help you. If you cover us call this round. Said. What's the bet? I've wondered. He's on a hot streak. Are they hustling him right now? Ha! I thought you said he was on a hot streak. Stop your crying. You'll rust. Since the contact will rendezvous with the hangar. That's a bug. Don't overcook it! Unlike it medium rare! A Mandalorian covert is close. The contact will lead to them. How much will it cost me? It's the great news. It's free. What's the not great news? Nothing. It's all great. Okay. However, the contact wants passage to the system. Do you vouch for them? On my life. No hyperdrive. You want me to travel sublight? Deals off. These are mitigating circumstances. I'm not a taxi service. No, but I can vouch for her. Her? She needs her eggs fertilized. If you jump into hyperspace, Ooh. they'll die. She said all that? I paraphrased. Do you know the husband? No, I just met her 10 minutes before you walked in. I thought you said you vouched for her on your life. I'm an excellent judge of character. <laughs> oh, what? I don't speak whatever language that is. She's kind of cute. I've set the nav for our course. I recommend you get some rest. Kid? Kid. No, 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 no. Don't do that again. Is she gonna notice that? He ate her spawn? Is there a problem? This sector is under New Republic jurisdiction. All craft are required on a beacon. Thank you for letting me know. I'll get right on it. No problem. Safe trap. May the force be with you. And also with you. <laughs> Just one more thing. I need you to send us a pin. Doesn't seem to be uh, working. Are these like air space police? We got a runner. Stand back. We will fire. I'm confused. What? Oh, because he's wanted. Free fall? On purpose? Is this the plan any wanted to go to? Don't make us do it. Hold on. Uh oh. 
I should probably check on my baby. Um, that's not great news. I'll have you eggs, don't worry. <gasps> Where's the eggs? And the kid. No, I told you not to do that. <laughs> Found them. Guest, we're in a tight spot. The hall has lost its integrity. <laughs> Whatever it is, you can wait until morning. I recommend you get some sleep. Is he gonna sleep in his metal? It's gonna be so uncomfortable. Cold. Wake up, Mandalorian. This cannot wait until morning. Do not be alarmed. I access this vocabulator. So it's translating. These eggs are the last fruit of my life cycle. My husband has risked his life to carve out an existence for us. Oh. Lady, the deal is off. We're lucky if we get off this frozen tomb with our lives. I thought honoring one's world was a part of the Mandalorian tomb. I guess those are just stories for children. If anyone can do it, he can. This is an part of the deal. I don't understand how we come back from this. This ship looks very, very bad. Is he trying to talk? That doesn't seem safe. Where was she trying to go? Gather these up. I know it's warm. The night's coming fast, and I can't protect you out here. Don't do it. No. How bad does Mando just want to hop in there? Yeah, this looks like from the Alien movie. She likes to eat yucky thing. Oh boy. Oh my sickness. Oh no. Where there's babies, there is mommies. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Ew! Why? Why does there always have to be a spider? A giant flippin' spider? Oh, there's too many. Oh, crap. Why do they have brains on their butts? I hate them. <sighs> Even if they get back to the ship, what's the ship gonna do? It's like the Disneyland ride. The ship's got a giant hole in it, though. <gasps> ew! Ew, no! No, 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 no! <gasps> no, 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 no! <laughs> His little baby arm was gonna get it. Stop your son's head. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Um, do something. Are those the fighter guys? Can they really make webs that quick? Oh, hey. <laughs> we ran the tabs on the Razor Crest. You apprehended three priority culprits from the wanted register. Put your own life in harm's way to try to protect Lieutenant Davin. Am I under arrest? Technically, you should be. His good deeds. But these are trying off. times. Let's say I forego the bounties on these three criminals, and you two help me fuse my hole so I can get off this frozen rock. What say you fix that transponder, and we don't vaporize that antique the next time we patrol the rim? They're not going to help him? But they're not arresting him either. We've got a spider carcass to take care of. I'm gonna repair the cockpit enough for us to limp to Trask. It's the only thing I can pressurize. If you need to use the privy, do it now. It's gonna be a long ride. 
Oh, you see those? Well, I'm impressed. Wake me up if someone shoots at us or that door gets sucked off its rails. <laughs> Kidding. If that happened, we'd all be dead. Sweet dreams. You little sneaky guy. Oh, they're in a bad way. That one went fast. I have mentioned, but the art at the end of the episode is really cool. I just watched the whole thing go by. We didn't get a, I mean, we got a resolution from that episode as in we left the planet. We are limping, as he said, to Triss. I feel like that was kind of like in between your episode, but I was into it. I liked seeing those. Hi, this is pilot one fighter red team. Those guys, BB Yoda, just cute as ever, frog lady. She seems like a good mom. Spider is disgusting, will haunt my nightmares. His voice, as good as ever. He always says the right thing. He tries to be so tough, and he is. He is so tough, but he is so good. His heart is so good. Okay, next please. 